The International Sikh Youth Federation is a proscribed organization that aims to establish an independent homeland for the Sikhs of India in Khalistan. It is banned as a terrorist organization under Australian, European Union, Japanese, Indian, Canadian and American counter-terrorism legislation. Government of India has declared it a terrorist organization. Topic: History and activities. In 1984, the All India Sikh Students Federation started the ISYF in the United Kingdom as an international branch. The 1985 bombing of Air India Flight 182 off Ireland, the deadliest aircraft terror attack until the September 11, 2001 attacks, and the attempted bombing of Air India Flight 301, were allegedly carried out by Sikh extremists. Inderjit Singh Riyat, a member of the ISYF, was found guilty of manslaughter for making the bombs and had to spend more than 20 years in prison at Kenyatta, and is the only individual convicted in these attacks as of 9 February 2009. ISYF members have engaged in terrorist attacks, assassinations, and bombings against both Indian figures and moderate Sikhs opposing them. The organization has also collaborated and associated with other Sikh terrorist organizations, including Babur Khalsa, the Khalistan Liberation Force, and Khalistan Commando Force. Lord Bassam of Brighton, then Home Office Minister, stated that ISYF members working from the UK had committed assassinations, bombings, and kidnappings, and were a threat to national security. In 2001, it was proscribed as a terrorist organization by the British government for its attacks. Leadership Jasbir Singh Road was the nephew of Bindranwale and member of fundamentalist Sikh organization Damdami Taksal. After Operation Blue Star while in Pakistan Road used the Sikh shrines at Pakistan to make anti-India speeches and provoked the audience to attack the Indian diplomats who were present. Road then arrived in the United Kingdom in August 1984. On 23 September 1984, at a meeting in Walsall, the formation of International Sikh Youth Federation was announced by Harpal Singh and Jasbir Singh Road. The group had a 51-member panel headed by Pargat Singh. But, by December 1984, Road was expelled from the UK for publicly advocating violent methods in support of the Khalistan movement. Road then flew around seeking asylum, and was arrested in Manila by the Indian authorities in a chase across Thailand and Philippines. He was imprisoned for two years in India. Upon his release, he moderated, now advocating pursuing constitutional changes within Indian framework. This mode disappointed many of his followers and created a rift in the UK branches roughly along north south lines. The northern branches known as ISYF Road followed Road's moderate stance while the southern branches instead followed Dr Sohan Singh, the current leader of ISYF. Lakbir Singh Road is sought for trial in India. He is wanted in cases of arms smuggling, conspiracy to attack government leaders in New Delhi and spreading religious hatred in Punjab. Per Indian sources, he is currently living in Lahore, Pakistan. Topic: <inaudible> Pakistan. There are allegations that the ISYF has long been supported by Pakistan's Inter-Services Intelligence Organization. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Bannings. United Kingdom In February 2001, the United Kingdom banned 21 groups, including the ISYF, under the Terrorism Act 2000. The ISYF was removed from the list of proscribed groups in March 2016, following receipt of an application to deproscribe the organization. India In 2002, the ISYF was banned in India. It remains banned in India as of 2018. Topic: <inaudible> Japan. Japanese government banned it in 2002. Topic: 
Canada. In June 2003, Canada banned the organization. The Vancouver Sun reported in February 2008 that Singhs were campaigning to have both the Babur Khalsa and International Sikh Youth Federation delisted as terrorist organizations. The article went on to state that the public safety minister had never been approached by anyone lobbying to delist the banned groups and said, "...the decision to list organizations such as Babur Khalsa, Babur Khalsa International and the International Sikh Youth Federation as terrorist entities under the criminal code is intended to protect Canada and Canadians from terrorism." USA. <laughs> <laughs> The ISYF was added to the U.S. Treasury Department terrorism list on June 27, 2002. In April 2004, the United States added four organizations, including the ISYF, to its terror list, allowing the U.S. to deny entry and to deport any of its members. See also Sikh extremism